Hey, welcome back. Uh, today, I want to show you guys uh, some feature scripts, some custom features here that are available in Onshape. Uh, other people created them. It's open source kind of stuff, uh, CAD software, so people are able to make their own, and uh, you're able to download them. I showed you guys a few with the uh, auto layout and laser joint uh, in the past. Today, I want to show you uh, the thread one and something to make a neural, you know, nice little grip on the top. So you see, I quickly drew a little bolt, and I threw on two of these custom features. The two I threw on were, if you go to Neural, you hit the filter button here and I choose the Feature Studio one because those are the actual uh, feature scripts. I chose this guy down here, Printable Neuraling version 14. You click on that. This one's got the ANSI and the ASME uh, choices, which is uh, what I want, real actual measurements. And then, for threads, I typed in thread creator. I tried a few. Uh, this is one that I ended up liking. Uh, again, because I can do ANSI and stuff. Uh, this PP thread creator here. Uh, I'll show you how to use both of them now. So here is my bolt head here. Uh, blank with no threads or neural on it yet. So if I go up to my... Uh, custom features here. We'll go to Thread Creator, and if I click on the surface that I want to thread, you'll see that it started an, uh, to put a thread on it. It's based on the pitch that you type in here. Uh, my diameter was the first number. This was a one inch uh, bolt head, bolt outer diameter. And then the pitch as one eighth would give me a one to eight uh, thread here. And you'll see a couple options like fully threaded, uh, start taper, things like that. So if I change this to distance, let's say, and I type in something like 1.25, it'll move the thread down from the top and not be threaded the whole way, which, you know, save yourself some stuff. And then let's actually definitely hit the taper on the bottom. That's better for things to go in, right? Uh, but there's my thread. You can absolutely change it around. This is why I like this one. It's got all these different options here. So you can do Acme thread, ISO threads, and changing all your values and all that. But for now, I will just stick to a standard ANSI thread, eighth inch pitch, one to eight. And there's the thread for that. Tapered. Uh, doesn't start at the end. And now for the neural, I actually am going to fillet these edges first to show you a feature in there. I just did a small little radius. Again, if you're printing things like that, you don't want those 90 degrees anyway. But if I go up to my neural, it's asking me edge to edge, right? So I'm going to choose the two edges of my uh, fillet here. The target, it'll be the part. And there's a bunch of different neurals you can choose. So here is a straight neural right? Just straight vertical lines here, and you can change a bunch of uh, the values to common ones. Uh, the diagonal neural, right? The lines will be on an edge or angle, I should say. And then the diamond neural, the fancy one, the one that might, uh, you might be more familiar with when someone says neural. But you can change a bunch of things here as well. Like for instance, if I don't want this to go in so far, or I want that front diamond to be a little larger. If I change that to like something like 75, and if I change my angle here to like 45, let's see what that does. It thinks a little bit. Um, again, right, this is web based CAD software. <laughs> Gotta go up to the cloud, and this is someone's feature script, so it takes a second sometimes, uh, especially with the thread one sometimes if you're doing some fine threads. But there you go. I now have a neural check mark on that and you can see this is just a basic little bolt head i think the whole thing i made is an inch and a half extrude there the top was a half inch yeah bottom was an inch and a half so this is now you know, a usable bolt with a knurled grip now you can print it and give that a go as well uh but you know custom features very useful made that quick and easy did that in like a minute right good luck have fun